Brian, we thank you so much. A reminder, this morning we are committed to you, and as those temps continue to drop, we just want to make sure that you are safe and prepared for all that cold weather. Fox Carolina's Lindsay Gibbs is live in our Fox Carolina garden. She joins us now to give us some tips on how we can best protect ourselves and our families. Hey, good morning. I've been out here all morning long. It's still bundled up. You can feel that bite as, you, as soon as you step outside, but below 32 is considered freezing. So we do have a couple of different things of water. We have one in a metal ice cream scooper and water in a paper cup. And we're going to test how long it takes to freeze throughout the morning as long as those temperatures stay below 32 degrees. But really, according to the National Weather Service, they say it's best to stay indoors as much as possible when it comes to cold temperatures like this outside. Now, we do have some tips as those temperatures drop below freezing overnight. Many people are turning up the heat in their homes, including using space heaters. Remember, you should never plug a space heater into an extension cord. It must be plug directly into an outlet and you need to keep it away at least three feet away from anything flammable. Now another safety tip and never use a gas oven to heat your home. According to the National Weather Service, carbon monoxide kills about 1000 people a year. So make sure you have a properly working carbon monoxide detector in your home. Uh, when it comes to wood burning stoves in fireplaces, always keep a screen around an open flame. Never use gasoline to start your fireplace. Never burn charcoal indoors and do do not close the damper when the ashes are hot. Now we do have lots of tips coming up. We're going to have more on how we can keep you and your pets at home warm during this cold weather and stay safe as well. Chris.